I'm at the Maribor Military and Colonial Museum on Wharf Street, Maribor, with museum founder John Myers. Now, John, you have thousands of people come through here every year. What are they looking to see? Uh, primarily, it's uh, the, the interest in military history, yeah. which is what we um, really promote mm -hmm. here. Um, but the f main focus, as far as the museum is concerned, is not so much the wars, but yeah. the people that fought in the wars. Yeah. And wherever, wherever possible, we try to uh, promote local yeah. uh, residents who mm -hmm. went away and served somewhere in a uh, campaign. Yeah. And you have thousands of artifacts. Can we have oh, a look? Yes, we yeah. can. So, John, you have a number of VCs here. Uh, who, where, whose war medals are these? Okay, uh, George, these are the um, Victoria, original Victoria Cross Military Cross Group mm -hmm. to a Lieutenant Herbert James, mm -hmm. who served with the 4th Battalion, the Worcestershire Regiment, um, and he gained this Victoria Cross for um, two brave reactions on the 28th of June and the 3rd of July 1915 at Gallipoli. At Gallipoli. This has got a very interesting local history. Um, during World War I, we um, had two brothers that went away, Stan Warrior and Victor Worry. Um, and anyway, Stan Warrior is with the 42nd Battalion, and Stan's father uh, presented this bugle mm -hmm. to uh, a reinforcement unit that went over to France. And uh, anyway, sometime later, this bugle was found in the mud, yeah. and this wow. young soldier come yeah. up to, he cleaned the muck off it, and I uh, went up to Stan Warrior and said, Sir, he said, uh, it's got your name on it. And he yeah. said, Oh, yes, but he said, My father yeah. uh, presented that uh, bugle. Anyway, Stan brought it back from the war, mm -hmm. and for many years, uh, Peter Owls had it, I think, in his possession. Mm -hmm. uh, and then it went to the uh, Central, Central State School, school yeah. and then they've loaned it to the museum here. And it gets used every year for Anzac Day. Oh, yeah, very special. Yeah. <laughs> John, you've got three levels here of amazing artifacts and displays, including here the 1914-15 star for Duncan Chapman, the first man ashore at Gallipoli. Mm -hmm. uh, when can people come here and explore the, this amazing... They can come seven days a week, George, mm -hmm. uh, Monday to Friday, 9.30 to 3.30, mm -hmm. and uh, Saturday and Sunday, 9.30 to 12.30, and we've got... Uh, a hundred volunteers and supporters here to look after them. Mm -hmm. So, George, in your travels, if you can tell everybody that uh, they're more than welcome to come here, mm -hmm. uh, that uh, we will look after them very well as one of the tourist attractions yeah. here in Miraburra. Yeah, thank you.